With just a few easy steps, these smashed potatoes are a cinch to make. These golden potatoes are crispy on the outside and creamy on the inside. And in my opinion, one of the best ways to enjoy potatoes. We've steamed the potatoes for the other recipes, but for this recipe, we are boiling them. And it only takes about eight to nine minutes for uniform potatoes such as these. Use potatoes that are no bigger than an inch and a half across. And we're using white potatoes, which are really yellow skinned. We're using red bliss potatoes, which are red skinned. And we're using a little blue potato, which is purple skinned. Inside the flesh is blue. And uh, we put this in a pot of water that's over a high flame and bring to a boil and cook until the potatoes are soft to the point of a sharp knife. That's going to take somewhere about eight to nine minutes. You'll drain them and let them cool until they're not too hot to smash with the heel of your hand. Now we have some that are already done so I can just proceed with the recipe. Oil, a baking sheet like this with olive oil. And here's our potatoes. And you just take your hand like that and smash, just like that. A white one, a purple one, and here's a red one. And these can be put quite close on the baking sheet. They're not going to grow or expand or do anything like that. And just, they look like little flowers, kind of smashed flowers on the baking sheet and they heat in the oven so nicely, they roast now. And if they're too hot, use a little towel, a little piece of towel over the potato, but it's better, I think, to let them cool enough so that you can handle them. Now, there's just two pounds of potatoes here. They should all fit on this baking sheet. And then just sprinkle a little tiny bit more olive oil on the tops. Sprinkle with a little bit of salt and pepper and some thyme leaves. Put them in a 425 preheated oven and roast for, oh, about 25 minutes. Now just strip the leaves off the stems and sprinkle making sure that each potato has a little bit of time on it. So there, these go straight into your oven. Now you could substitute rosemary or parsley if you prefer those uh, herbs to thyme, but I love potatoes and thyme. Twenty-five minutes, 425. So you can arrange these on a serving platter. Uh, you can just dump them on a serving platter if you like, but I think they're so pretty that uh, they should be treated with tenderness. And these are so crispy and pretty. During the baking, you can turn them over. These were turned over once, but you can see the different colors. And you can serve these plain like this, or if you like, with a dollop of sour cream and sprinkle with chopped chive. Now that is a pretty platter of smashed potatoes. They'd be great to serve at a party like this, an inexpensive hors d'oeuvre, or with a roast or a steak, uh, anything you choose. Thank you so much for watching, and I hope you'll join me on the next episode of Cooking School.